purple, and that's mine. That's my first TOB KC, so I'm hoping for either a Reaper, Defender, or, you know, Scythe saying it. Hello, and welcome to episode 12. I uh, kind of feel like Midkip because I'm at the pond as well, but uh, ignore that. I'm just fishing here for some diary stuff. And speaking of diary stuff, this episode we're going to be focusing on a lot on diaries and a lot on Slayer. I want to push for that little called Necklace, which is Nandri Slayer, and we're currently at 91 Slayer. So we should pick that this episode. As well as we want to do a little bit of raids because I want to use a called Necklace. As well as a little bit of TOB because maybe I can stack up myself an early purple on load. Try to low KC, but I do have enough drop uh, kill count that I'm expecting a purple and uh, the diary stuff is going to be very important because as soon as I get 95 slayer I want to be able to have the Kepo's diary completed and what that's allow me to do is not only use the shortcut but also wear just regular boots in the dungeon so I can increase my DPS a little bit but for that I need 7-7 runecraft again since I don't plan on plus 5 boosting I want to do a lot of diaries for runecrafting XP because those speed lamps are gonna come in nicely. Thanks so much for watching and enjoy the video. Also, I wanna apologize that I lost a lot of clips on my computer, and one of those clips is unfortunately also Rigger, because I already have Rigger, but I don't have a clip of it, so there's just the intro of that. I have Rigger now. Uh, the other one thing I forgot to mention is sorry so much for a lot of time between episodes. I'm getting into a stage where I'm just not making as much progress, progress and I'm getting very low clips because I'm kind of in the end game of Iron Man as weird as it sounds. So time just takes a long time. I'd rather have some good quality over quantity and unfortunately this week, this week's episode is going to have a lot less quantity. There we go. There is 83 smithing. Many more are come to come. And there is 84 smithing. While my level 2 came in, Runite Bars. A momental level coming in, 85 smithing. We can now finally make Runite Bars, bars and we can also make some spiritual spirit shields and infernal pickaxes, not to mention. Very good, very nice, very nice. Just because I got 85 doesn't mean I'm gonna stop, and there's not level coming in, 86. Well, I was out of ores, but it doesn't mean I'm out of bars. And here's another interesting level. Here's 87. I bet you didn't see that coming. No smitty clip. Don't forget your weekly runecrafting XP. Maybe a little bit of a random level, but all the smithing gave me a lot of fletching XP, and here is 87 fletching. And our final smithing level coming in, there is 88 smithing, with a plus 1 boost I can finally make runite darts, nice. Probably like the most random place to get the, this, but here is 99 range, I am now the most proficient range person in the game. <laughs> thank you friends, thank you, thank you. After making most of our runite darts, there is 88 flexion. Huh, I just missed 91 slayer, which is uh, Cerberus, nice. Ooh, a quick ten tentacle. Any excess of these are not really useful because I already have a tentacle whip, but if I have 10 of them, I can imbue my trident. That will make it hold more charges. Nice. So, just out of sight of the cave, if there's a guy, he can give you a tentacle too. You don't have to give him all at once, you need to give him one by one. You will not get them back anyway, but this is a monarchman, I don't really uh, use him anyway. So, I always just paid for the boat to drink this island to get this lead, but apparently, you can just pay him a few bucks. Or a few extra tokens and you can just go there for free, so do that now. And that is number two. Huh. And there is 92 Slayer. Not really anything major in the here, but one more level until we can finally get the occult necklace, which is a 10% magic bonus damage boost, which is very huge for this account. I'm only close to this and I just got a longbow. Huh. Huh, and drain to edge. I actually need that for a clue, so that's kinda nice. So with this red chin, I get 90 Hunter. Nice. Hey, there's a Gold Sword Star too. Unfortunately, we already have one of those and we're missing three, but hey, I'll take a duplicate. Oh, that's a 1 in 416. Wow, we just got our tool gem. Um, 
Unfortunately, that's the same drop rate as a good heart, but it's kind of useful. Also, a free 5 mil I didn't have, so I can't complain. So, with this eternal crystal, I can make an eternal gem, and it's just a slayer gem I can just use forever and has infinite charges, so it will be useful forever, eternally. Woo, the purple, and it's mine. It's my first EOB, Casey, so I'm hoping for either a rapier, defender, or you know, so I'm saying anything. Just no, just a piece. We get. Holy fuck, we just got a rapier, boys. I'm just. Damn, what the. I just kind of missed 97 attack, I'm sorry. There we go. Here's a very momental level coming up. 90 Tree Slayer. This means I can now kill Smoke Devils, and this means the Cold Necklace, which is the plus 10% magic damage. Nice. Ha! Huh, we already got it. 42k Sea Cold. What a joke. And I put this Cold Ornament Kit I got from like episode 5 or something on this Cold, and it's really pretty now. Nice. And also gets 10%. Nice. I don't think I can pass this dude. Ooh, a purple. And it's mine. And it's an arcane. That, for most people, it would probably be bad, but I need it. And with this arcane, I can now finally play augury. This is gonna be so nice for solos. And I can put this back. Nice. Team to Zoro, I needed skills. Got the skills. Nice. Sorry for anyone who's drowned in Magic Fang, but I need the skills. So, a little bit back, I told you about I needed 70 runecrafting to put my diaries into runecrafting. And now we've actually got the 70 runecrafting, so we can actually complete the diaries. So, I actually completed the Kender and Diary earlier, so let's claim that reward. With this Kender headgear, I can actually go to Strodok very easily, and this runecrafting key is gonna come in nicely. So, I actually then lay, um, Used almost all my chromons, so I ended up cooking all my chromons right now and just a little bit of one ticking. But this is 92 cooking. I uh, really needed these chromons. Save me, I mean, 83 agility. Just two more levels for 85 for the diary for Ara. There's 86 thieving. Just need a few more levels until we can get 91 thieving for the last four permanent plunder for the diary. And then I ran the level I was close to 84 wood giving. So, I finally completed my first TOB deal with uh, Kurt. Thank you so much for the carry, Kurt. He has Scythe Idol, so he's a big character in this uh, deal. But hey, I can't just leech off and uh, I had to do something. Unfortunately, no purple, but you know, it is what it is. And there's a second deal with TOB completion. We had a lot of thefts in this one, but we managed to complete it nonetheless. Uh, this is very good, but. Unfortunately, no purple. So I didn't really go over this in the last clip, or last few clips, but uh, I need 85 agility for uh, a plus 5 boost with Stormify in order to complete the Ardon course, and that's needed for the Ardon diary. So we're working on agility right now, as you can maybe see, and here is 84 agility. And there is 85 agility. We can finally move on from agility for a while, because I'm on higher level. And with this last step of the way, we have completed our Ardon lap, and we can finally retrieve our XP lamp from Ardon. Even Darius. Nice. And we talk to Pins to get our XP lamp straight into room crafting. And this Ardon cloak is gonna send us to Ardon farm a minute time of the week rather than five times. Nice. So I don't really record outdoors that much. Uh, as you can see, that all my past videos did not have any outros, but I decided to throw one in. I had some comments with people saying it's kind of abrupt ending, and I don't know. I, I usually don't really mind using the outro, but people say it's a lot of people don't even listen to the outro. So, uh, thanks so much for watching. Have a good one. Hope you uh, like the video, and if you do, please leave a like, subscribe, and Make, leave a comment, a nice comment. If you're here in the video, say what your fi favorite fruit is. Mine is probably an apple, because I like apples. Thanks so much for watching, and have a good one.